Maybe there was something on the bridge. I checked every other inch of the boat. I just want to see a secret real quick. Look at this. Whoa. You get a Liberace. Uh, uh, sh I was going to say a shotgun. I <laughs> spotted Passos <laughs> and Marcello. K47. If I'd known back then that they'd been up to no good while I was fighting my way through a band of violent paramilitaries and a worse hangover, I might not have wanted to get over to them so bad. Hey, Passos! At the time, I hadn't thought too much about this. I hadn't thought too much about anything. Now I remember it, it didn't seem quite so kosher. What about, what's her name? Daphne. I do whatever you think is best. I think it's best we try to go find her. Yeah, okay, let's go. What the fuck? See, I didn't think Passos was a bad guy. He didn't need to try to save this woman or the crew. We're here. Using that building to get across the canal. This is such a fucking bad. Oh god. There was some equipment in the truck. Oh, I got him! I fucking got him! What? There you go. Fucking double tap just in case. We can get across up top. Shoot me without like actually to find what the fuck? on a boat full of drunks and bullshit artists. I'd been the cabaret act. Shooting whatever came in front of me was easier than coming to terms with that reality. There it is. I see it. I almost missed it. Yoink. Seeing you here. For, for real, like what? Out of all places to find painkillers, it would be here. Oh, I thought that was a gold piece, but it's just fucking. Fucking found it. Hey, Stroya Trabado, motherfucker. Let's go inside. But before we go inside, there it is. 
Oh, that's for the super shot. Ah, fuck. Okay, there's still one more then. Ah! I'm pretty sure there was one in there and I missed it. I really fucking hope not. I really hope there wasn't the AK part wasn't up there, but I'm pretty sure it's not because there was like one right here. So it can't be. It can't. It does no fucking conceivable fucking way. Okay. Shotgun. That looked like the way up, but it was locked. I had to find a switch. There was probably a control console behind the desk. For parts, Max. No time for that. My own private welcoming party. Yeah, then why the fuck are you running away? Why are you running away? Oh yeah? That's who? That's who? Oh fuck, I hit the wall. That was, that was pretty close. I nearly fucked that. I fucked that up. Eagles. Isn't it there an exception? Somewhere here. No, no, no goal, no goal part either. So move forward. Oh, there's gotta be one in here. There's like, there has to be one in here. What? No? That's crazy. Dude, this has to be like a, a golden part area right here. Like you would find a golden piece in here, right? Oh no, there's nothing in here. I've been bamboozled. Fine, 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 fine. Hey, where's the other guy then? Or the last guy, I should say. Americans had a long and checkered history of involvement in Panama. This was my sorry chapter, for what it's worth. Okay, now we need the last fucking AK part, and I don't know where that is. Jesus Christ. There's, there's Daphne. No, I didn't miss it. So it was inside, motherfucker. It was inside, motherfucker. I missed the AK. I missed the AK. Fuck, man. This is brutal. I didn't think things would be like this.
I should have jumped in that goddamn canal myself and swum my way back to New York. Let me ask you again, Max. What do you think you were really doing in Panama? I was drinking. People die. Innocent people. Who do you think robbed you? I don't know. I was told it was people who disliked Daphne Bernstein. Something about an unpleasant divorce. Her ex-husband worked on Wall Street. Do you think he has easy access to Panamanian death squads? Guess I didn't really think about it. You were smuggling something. Weren't you? No, no, no. I mean, I didn't realize it at the time. I, I didn't think too much about it, but yes, Marcelo did drive off with something. I don't know what. I didn't see him until we got to Brazil a week or so later. I think it was money. I think Marcelo and Victor have a friendly banker there in Panama. Your little cruise was to deliver the cash to him because there it's easier to launder. But I thought the Broncos were rich. Harigo's rich. The other two, they live well, but they don't have real money. Victor's campaigns were always financed by his brother. That is the way among certain rich families there. The eldest brother is the king. You know, he gets everything. The other two, not so much. And now Rodrigo's dead. Exactly. And Marcelo, too. It's an awful tragedy for Victor, huh? A man running on a law and order ticket, you know, whose brothers have both been killed in such terrible circumstances. A true patriot. What about Marcelo? Marcelo. Marcelo was an idiot. Were this true, I certainly don't believe he could possibly have known about it. But I do believe some other scheme, you know, some other bullshit. Whatever that cash was, Victor could have talked him into something. I don't know yet. And Passos? Raul well, Passos is a bum ex-cop. Failed in America. Failed in Sao Paulo. He was surrounded by more money and more poverty than his tiny little head can handle. You think guys like that can't be bought? No, but if... But nothing. He's probably not a bad guy. He's just a man caught in the crossfire of a very rich family. What about me? You. You're the fall guy. You're the American. Running around, acting like the action hero. Killing lots of people. <laughs> You're a stroke of genius. That ain't how it is. You were an angry ex-cop. You were sitting in a bar with a history of violence and a history of a bad temper. You were perfect. Me and Passos went to the academy together. Did you? I don't fucking know. Holy <laughs> shit. Okay, let's take a drive, Max. Yeah, Wanna sure. Wanna do I'll... some good? Hmm? Wanna get yourself killed in a good cause? And I need you to check something Damn, out. Damn, dude, I fucking missed that AK, dude. Watch. I have to go back for it now. An incident at the favela today. Some of my officers say a bus drove off some. Oh, campus. um, I went back and collected no a lot of the collectibles and golden parts. Probably handed them off to the paramilitary death squads. The uh, Casa Preto. Right. Who did? I don't know. The cops. The other cops. The cops who shoot on sight. The Ufe. Right. Max, you see that building there? The Imperial Palace Hotel. Yeah, that's what it says. People go in there. In large groups under armed guard, but it isn't a police station, and no one comes out of there. Why don't you just go in and bust the joint? Get a warrant. I'm only a cop, Max. <laughs> so you keep saying. <clears throat> I'm a fog guy. Find out what was going on here. I didn't fancy booking myself in the presidential suite, so went looking for the basement. Great American, area of the four. I wasn't too excited about the acoustics in this place. A couple of gunshots would sound like I'd walked in here with a goddamn marching band. It wasn't pretty, but I guess none of what was about to happen was gonna be. <laughs> it's not. A, it's not a really good surprise. It's like a one-time thing, and then that's it. Was it was the question I kept on asking myself. How could I have been so blind? I was convinced the plot. Uh, two weapon parts. I mean, th like two weapons and like six clues. Broncos okay. had gotten the wrong man for the job, but maybe De Silva was right. I was the stooge. 
the bad joke everybody got but me. Looking around so I don't miss anything. I guess it was just a, a walk in, I guess. Got here. Either those guys wheeled their trash out on stretchers, or something was seriously wrong here. I'd thought about this too much, I'd never get through it. Ufe. Was there anything they didn't have a grubby hand in? A few days earlier, I'd have called it a coincidence. But I'd written off too many of those already. I fucking love the dialogue in this game. It's really good. People say, yeah, dude. Like, uh, I think somebody on, on a comment for a video was checking a Max Payne 2 and a Max Payne 3 comparison. And, or like a Max 1, Max 2, and Max 3 comparison. They said the one, the the good thing about each one of them is that the first one the is the atmosphere. The second one was the story. Shit. And then the third one was like to find the out. combat. I guess we're checking in by the bus load and checking out by the bag load. That's, Maybe the service would yeah. be better upstairs. That was his opinion though, so I wouldn't really know because I've never played Max Payne 1. And I probably can't because my PC is just like, eh, I don't think you can. You mean I can or I won't? Mm, yeah, you probably won't. You never will. Sorry, buddy. I'm like, okay, thank you, PC. There it is. There's an RPG part. Um, have we ever used an RPG? No, we have not. Oh, this one's got a flashlight. I'll take this one. Let's illuminate my way in the darkness. For golden parts or clues? I think he even said, he, look out, he's coming in this direction. Come on, motherfuckers. Give me a bitch. Ah. Fuck. More for you, buddy. Just gonna stand up and maybe take your guard up, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, right through the fucking neck. This guy's got carrying this ammo. Huh? I don't even have to use my sidearm. Switch your weapons faster than reloading. Okay, let's go. Oh, the button. Fucking god damn it. The button pusher. I'm the fucking button pusher. Great. Thanks for acknowledging that game. Ah! Fuck. 
to hurt. Yeah, hey, see you going to part two. You know, usually when I'm looking for golden parts, I always miss the second part. I always get the first and the third, but I can never get the second one. It's like a curse or some shit. And I got RPDs, but like, honestly, dude, I don't think you'll need an RPD because like, I feel like the accuracy would be super shit. I was just here. Okay. I'm so, I just want to backtrack just, just in case. Alright, alright, alright. Pull apart, clue, nothing. Okay. You sure? Right. Oh, fuck! <laughs> God damn it, Max. Just get the fuck up there, dog. Oh, get an RPD. Here's a clue. De Silva and I had the same fan club. I knew enough, and he knew too much. We'd both become targets. Uh, I missed a fucking clue. No way. Where? Oh, damn it, dude! I swear, I'm gonna miss these fucking clues everywhere. Oh shit! Oh! <laughs> That's literally the last thing I would have expected, dude. Holy shit. <laughs> I was like, hmm, I think I'm clear. I think I'm all good. Turn around gets fucking shot by three you guys can't in the corner. See something, but you can dull the effect. Yeah, this guy was here. All right, all right. Sorry for my. I just... knew this thing was bigger than me, bigger than the Broncos, but I only had a glimpse of the whole picture, like looking in the mirror and for an instant seeing what everyone else sees, a bad caricature of a better man. Another RPG part. I really hope these, these golden parts are not as hard to miss as the fucking clues. Did I intentionally do that? I don't know. Bouffe. That deal at the favela was getting dirtier by the minute. Those bastards were clearly in bed with the crush of Prado. Now we just had to find out why. Starting with a bit of bedtime reading for Mr. Da Silva. When you've lived the kind of life I've lived, Reality comes at you through a different lens. But nothing could have prepared me for what was on the other side of that door. I had to get those poor bastards oh out of there. Oh my god. Yeah, I, I remember. I said get... Serrano. Serrano. Fuck! Pathetic. A man defeated. I walked away and left him to his own personal nightmare. They fucked him up! Hey, yeah, fuck you. Go fuck yourself, asshole. I could have saved fucking Fabiana and everything. Whatever you decided to be a piece of was, shit. Whatever De Silva had sent me into, I knew I had to put an end to it. That's fucked, dude. Holy shit. I had None no of those people were deformed. Push on. I didn't understand everything. And I never would, but I understood enough. Sometimes a complicated problem is best tackled with a simple solution. I dropped my fucking gun too. What the fuck? <laughs> fucking bitch.
think I'm good. I think. That's a big fucking word right there. Ah! <laughs> fucking shit. Fucking ran out of ammo the worst fucking possible time. Oh fuck, you're not getting me too. She's already running out of ammo. I'll take my chances with this guy. I feel like a oh, fuck. Oh, that was, <laughs> that was a chair, was it a chair? Fucking stupid, I scared myself. Running. I'm gonna dodge too because I don't want to get fucking hit and I can't be able to fucking shoot him. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be locked? hell on earth. De Silva was no fool. I'd have driven on off into the sunset too if I were him. But I was in too far now. Hopefully I got it all. Hopefully it actually works. There it was. The soundtrack to my life. And, for a few seconds, came harmony. Hell Fine. yeah. The original Max Payne soundtrack. Cool. I didn't get the achievement for it because I don't know. I think I yeah, I think you're supposed to do it in one entire run, I think, or something like that. I don't know, but I missed it though. Alright, let's get to it. Ew, what the fuck? What is going on here? How, how much do you want? What have you been doing? I am a doctor. I help people. What have you been doing here? It's easy for you. Listen, I know people. They will kill you. I can help you. Trust me. Please, please. What have you been doing? I have a lot of money. Look, look. Lots of money. I do important research, please. Caralho! Caralho! 
Espera, espera. Eu posso explicar tudo. Tudinho. It's like, I, I can explain everything. I think. Like I said, I don't speak Portuguese, dude. Não, não. Por favor. Braz uh, like, if people say, oh, they speak Brazilian, no, it's, it's just Portuguese. I don't speak Portuguese, dog. But the Latin, like, the, some of the Latin is still there. I know he's a doctor. 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 He paid enough. For now, I had bigger debts to call in. Can I go back in? You guys, he locked the door. I don't know somehow he locked the door. Oh, this door. Oh, I docked that third too, somehow. Fuck. I probably have to end Even it soon. I guess what Demo Lee Sal meant. That building was condemned in more ways than Okay. No, actually, I still have time. I still have time. I do have, okay. I will have to finish, like, in a couple minutes, though. Uh, there's probably a golden part somewhere here. I really don't want to miss any of the parts. Clues? Sure. Like, I can get these clues back. But, like, golden parts? Like, ooh. I got a gold gun. I feel like the man with the gold gun. There had to be something I wasn't seeing. It was locked from the outside. Hmm. I'm trying to see if I can. Just... Oh yeah, look, 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 it's behind the couch. Found it. Found it. And then clues? I don't know. Clues are kind of hard to find because, like, I mean, sometimes they're obvious because they glow. They're like, they stand out for the rest of, like, they stand out than most of the objects around. Even then, I still can't find it with my two fucking brain cells. They had a fucking arsenal in here. It was time to bring this little hellhole to the ground. So I decided to put some of their C4 to good use. That must be scary just holding all that C4, dude. <laughs> this is like, you know how there's like fucking silly putty? Well, C4 is like serious putty. <laughs> can I go back in there? I can get an RPD. You can't unsee something. I said I can only can't get an RPD. Dull the effect. I'll keep, I'll keep this going because it's actually really decent. What the fuck? I hear a hel uh, helicopter. I don't think that's good. I got 16 fucking bullets in this fucking mag. I don't think it's gonna last. I'd seen some dark shit in my time, but this was something else. These vermin had gone into a place where life was cheap and found a way to get rich off it. I just wanted to finish this and get far away from here. But then, true to form, more of the rats came out of their holes. <laughs> Oh, don't tell me that was my last bullet. That was my At second to last. Visitors have been kind enough to leave the gate open. It was my second to last bullet. Holy shit, that was kind of cool. You guys were carrying uh, guns. I'll take that raging bolt though, just in case. <laughs> I had to sneeze. My bad. <laughs> I also got this one gold. I don't know how he survived that round. Do you think he survived that one? 
see the gold part. I see the gold part. Dude, dude, chest, like, I'm getting hit chest shots, and these guys are fucking taking them like it's no fucking problem. Fucking. Okay, I think we're good. Look, I see the fucking part too. <laughs> Say, let's go. Fuck. Apple. Ah, fuck. What the shit? Holy shit. Any time I bought, it been going real cheap. If I was going to plant the rest of those explosives, I had to do it now. Hold on, let me get this RPG part. Alright, we're good. We collected all the weapon parts. It seems. What the fuck? I missed. I missed. I went around him. <laughs> hmm, bitch. Sweating, Max. You good? That was the last of the explosives. I just hoped it was enough to bring down the building and all the evil in it. Bye, bye, copy the, copy the, bye. Who wants to take a shot? You see what this is? Come on, anybody? Want to be a hero? I got nothing to lose. Let's do it. Que porra que tá acontecendo aqui? Senor Nevis. What the fuck is your problem, man? <laughs> my problem? My problem? Wanna know what my problem is? You're turning humans into glue! That's what my fucking problem is! I don't know what you're talking about, American! All I know is what I hear about you. You bodyguard for the Brancos. They are all dead! You help the poor. Today, many of them dead. You are a proper American hero. At least I fucking tried. Well done with your effort. The whole city is grateful. The great American savior of the poor. That's right. You think you made any difference? You think stopping this legitimate business venture is helping anyone? Legitimate? You're stealing people's organs! We pay for everything! We have the records! Oh, so people can sell their livers, their hearts, their eyeballs? You're insane, you sick fuck! We kept people safe in the city! Decent people! Safe! I know a lot of powerful people. Well, your powerful people aren't gonna help you out of this one, buddy. Whoa. Ah, what the fuck am I using? What's my backup? What the fuck? Oh, there he is. I'm supposed to get a headshot during the tremors. Ah, there's nobody here, and it's kind of hard. Let's wobble a lot. Get up, Max. Get up, Max. We actually don't have any more pills. Fucking spare, willingly.
And I wanted to tremble. Fuck, I'm not even in the line of sight. Fuck! <laughs> I'm not even in the line of sight. Four, 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 four. four. What the fuck? That shit is so hard! I'm gonna get this fucking headshot. It is so difficult. <sighs> fuck it. I got it, I got it, I got it! <laughs> Actually, fucking got the headshot, dude. Holy shit. Well, that's a shotgun, dude. Don't fucking no wonder if I fucking got As soon as I step forward, too, it's like, I'm fucked. Ah, oh, motherfucker, it had to be him. So what I to do? There you go. Barely got him. <laughs> I told you the city wasn't dangerous, friend. Yeah, I kind of like it. It's growing on me. <laughs> <laughs> nice to see your happy tourists smiling. <laughs> came back. I can see that. But why? To save you. Wow, oh, yeah, real hero. Listen. Listen. Now, come with me, Max, to Brazil. The chance to play the fall guy in a plot that my boss and brother's hatching to profit from the selling of human organs. Yeah, it'll be perfect for you. What are you talking about? I don't know nothing about human organs, man. Victor and Marcelo are trying to teach Rodrigo a lesson. Get him to loosen the purse strings and the family money. They pressured me into doing it. You wanna die? I came back for you. I did my best. I'm having a kid, man. Who do you think I fucking saved go. your kid? Fuck you. Sure. Later. Now, let's go. Hope this thing works. I wonder how you even found me. I'm gonna be honest with you. There's no idea how he found me. Everything. No, you don't. I'm sorry I couldn't save your sister. I was there. It wasn't your fault. I was paid to protect her and I didn't. She married into a sick family. Maybe. I... I just wanted to say thank you. 
We're giving us a chance to live. I mean, as a family. I hope it all works out for you, for all of you. Thank you. Don't be too long. Well, buddy, that's it. Where are you guys gonna go? Uh, I don't know, maybe back to New York. Uh, maybe down to Argentina. Giovanna has family in Salvador. Maybe we'll just stay there. Yeah, I got business to take care of. Uh, I I'm sorry I, I dragged you into this. I, I know... Uh, I, I know it was very wrong. It's all right, it's done. But hey, I'm having myself a fun old time. Maybe this is how things had to be. Figure I might as well die in the sunshine as die in the snow. Look, I'm sorry I'm leaving. I, I got a kid coming. Yeah, yeah, you know, I guess. I Fuck off. Is. Go home, man. You know, I... I almost didn't say goodbye to you. I said to myself, maybe this guy will put a bullet in me. Maybe I will. But not right now. Thank you. Try to look after yourself, Max, huh? Life is worth living. If you say so, pal. I thought I was going to have to witness another murder. <laughs> nah. Not him. You, ready? you know what's funny? Where the fuck did we drop him off? Okay. It didn't look like we dropped him off at the airport or anything. We just dropped him like in the middle of the street. <laughs> it's not very nice. What is it? It's the Ufe. The famous Mr. Becker. Friend of Victor Bronco. <laughs> yes. And the contributor to his campaigns. A government employee, of course. And? A weapons dealer, a murderer, this was known, a dealer in human organs, this wasn't known. A proper gentleman. Mm, sure. So you're gonna bring him down? <laughs> yes, because I want to lose my wife and my children and then get killed myself. All that after watching him walk free. Tell me what has to be done. Well, officially there's uh, nothing I can do. And unofficially? Well, we can always try something a little more creative. Creative? De Silva had promised me a 10 o'clock showcase. I had to make sure I was on stage and ready for my close-up. Diga <laughs> Becker. Kevin Parel. Damn, they were fast to put those handcuffs on me. Just like click, click. I'm in. Hey, you don't gotta do all of that. You can just have one guy with a foul. I mean, you don't gotta have three of them. You know, if I was into something like this, like if I if I was the Ufei, and I was just like, hmm, this guy is turning himself in. The guy who killed a shit ton of our guys. Why is he turning himself in? Oh, I would I would have been like I would have been like, dude, no, this is this is some this is this got to be a fucking trick or some shit. I'm I'm leaving. Oh fuck, they rocked my shit. Ah oh, fuck. Ah. <laughs> Understand? I can't hear you. What are you, what doing, are you here? doing here? Hit me in the ear. Hey, answer me. What are you doing here? 
My guys are real fucking stupid. Mm, bitch. Rocking my fucking shit last time. I'll shoot you too, bitch. Stay down. Back in the precinct after all this time. Time to find out what the hell was going on. Oops. Oh. Wait, you guys still use 1911? What a fucking old bastard. Alright, guys. Um. Oh, fuck. I'm gonna end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um. Uh. I think. I think I only need, like. Like. Three. Three more. I think. I think it's this mission and then the next mission. And then. I think that's it. That's all the shit that I have to do, and then the game's over. So, um, I guess in two more episodes, or even one more episode, if I just do one long episode, we'll finish the game. Um, I really hope you guys are enjoying it. I'm really having a fun time with Max Payne 3. I love this game so much. Um, so yeah, if you like the video, give it a like. If you have, if you're new to this, please give it a give it a subscribe. Subscribe. Tell your friends about it. But like, hey, you want to, you did it, you know? Uh, so yeah, I guess see I see you guys in the, in the next video. <laughs> Hope you have a good one. Laters. And now, folks, it's time to say good night. We sincerely appreciate your patronage and hope we've succeeded in bringing you an enjoyable evening of entertainment. Please drive home carefully and come back again soon. Good night.